And we'll leave you with our special series, Chinese Terminology, where we will help explain the magnitude of China's reform and opening up, which is celebrating its 40th anniversary this year. And today, my colleague Jeff Moody looks at uh, the 10,000 yuan household, or one yuan hu in Chinese. So have fun. I'm Li Dongli in Beijing. Thanks for watching. What does 10,000 yuan mean to a modern family? That's about $1,500. It's hardly enough for a modest family holiday now, but in the late 70s and early 80s, it was a significant amount of money. Not many ordinary families would have had more than a thousand yuan in savings. In fact, the average monthly wage would have been a bit less than 30 yuan, which is not even five dollars. If a family had savings of 10,000 yuan, well, that family was certainly considered nouveau riche. China's senior leader at the time, Deng Xiaoping, wanted to help certain people in the country to get rich first with the aim of achieving prosperity for everyone. This has been, of course, a major government policy ever since then. And the emergence of China's reform and opening up program brought many families into this previously pretty exclusive group. So as China's economy really began to take off and with the spending power of its huge population, the term 10,000 UN household slowly became a bit redundant. In some developed regions in the country, it's certainly not rare to even find a million yuan household. And the 19th CPC National Congress has pointed out the need to narrow the gap between rich and poor and to take targeted measures in poverty alleviation.